Namaskar. Welcome to Divine Chemistry. I am Divya Shri. So throughout the uh, chapter of chemical bonding, we have came across the names of many great chemists like uh, Lewis, Pauling, Hitler and many more. So I thought why not uh, make a discussion on one of them because uh, it's quite interesting to know about their works, their achievements, their lives. So this video is not going to be anything about learning chemical concepts, but it is mainly about one of the great American chemists, Linus Carl Pauling. So he was the person who has been awarded two undivided Nobel Prizes, the Nobel Prize in Chemistry and also the Nobel Peace Prize. So let's have an overview of his life. So Linus Carl Pauling was born on 28th of February 1901 in Portland, Oregon, United States. He received his degree of B.Sc. in Chemical Engineering in 1922 and he was appointed a teaching fellow in chemistry in the California Institute of Technology and was a great uh, graduate student there from um, 1922 to 1925. And in 1925, he was awarded the PhD in chemistry with minors in physics and mathematics. So, uh, we all must be familiar about the fact that during the 1920s, there was a development in the field of quantum mechanics. So this development in quantum mechanics had a great impact not only on the field of physics but also in chemistry. So Linus, uh, Linus Pauling was the person who used quantum mechanics to understand and describe the chemical bonding that is the way the atoms join together to form molecules. And uh, this is the reason why we are learning about Linus Pauling in the chapter of chemical bonding. Because he worked in a broad range uh, within the uh, uh, field of chemistry. He also worked in the structure of biologically important chemical compounds. And interestingly, in 1951, he published the structure of the alpha helix, which is an important basic component of many proteins. We uh, all must be much familiar with the uh, famous alpha helix structure. It also acts as a background for the uh, model of Watson and Crick. And that is how in 1954, Linus Carl Pauling was awarded the Nobel Prize in Chemistry for his research into the nature of the chemical bond and its application to the elucidation of the structure of complex substances. Also, uh, the atom bombs dropped on Hiroshima and Nagasaki were a turning point in Linus Pauling's life as well. Because what happened, he spoke and wrote against the nuclear arms race and he was a driving force in the Pogwash movement. Pauling also drafted the famous Hiroshima Appeal. He urged the nuclear powers, the USA, the Soviet Union, the Great Britain to conclude a nuclear test ban treaty which entered into force on 10th of October in 1963. And interestingly, on the same day, the Norwegian Nobel Committee announced that Linus Pauling had been awarded the Nobel Peace Prize that had been held over from 1962. Thus, eight years later, in 1962, he was awarded the Nobel Peace Prize for his opposition to weapons of mass destruction. Thus, he became the person who has been awarded two individual Nobel Prizes. Now, uh, Linus Pauling married Eva Helen Pauling, who was also an American human rights activist, and they had four children together. And uh, in 1994, Linus Pauling finally died of prostate cancer at the age of 93 years old. So this is uh, all about Linus Carl Pauling. Obviously, not, uh, this is not everything about Linus Carl Pauling, but this is just a little overview, small overview about his uh, life, about his works, his achievements. And uh, thank you so much for your patience and thank you so much for listening to me. If you like the video, please give it a big thumbs up. And yes, uh, if you know anything else about or anything more about Linus Carl Pauling, then please do mention it in the comment section. I'll be much happy to uh, hear from you. And stay at home, stay safe, take care. Thank you.